facing downwards for this box and there is also this roof surface facing upward they are overlapping at the they are overlapping at the same location so if you include all these surfaces in your analysis then you will have two surfaces overlapping and you will have zero values that will affect your visualization and calculus so i will recommend you to clean up the geometry remove whatever geometry inside the view that is not necessary for your simulation or, mm. or, or uh, if you want as you suggest I only want to analyze this patch of surfaces facing east uh, so in Rhino positive Y is the due north mm. positive X means the east direction mm. uh, because you can see this is the top view so this is okay. north uh, so if you only want to include the east facing facades uh, in your analysis you can isolate them uh, for example let's clean up this clean value i empty the container empty whatever con concern in container of this and then right click i select multiple b-rep mm -hmm. uh, let me deselect them first if i want to select multiple b-reps let's move it to this view Worry, I may need to uh, may select some services I don't want. Okay, la, yeah, right. Mm. Once it's down, hit enter. Mm. The geometry will be imported over here. And remember to lock it. You have to internalize. Yeah, internalize. Once it's internalized, the text of internalized data will become grayed out. So now, this has all the buildings. Yes. There are all the services, and this has only one surface. Yes. So now the context will be different. The most safe way to, how to say, define context is just to include every geometry within your model. Even the ones you are analyzing? Yes, including the target surface itself. Uh, it doesn't matter. If you really want to differentiate them very clearly, sure. In this case, the context, for example, let's bake the context geometry back into Rhino. In this case, I have to reselect the context geometry. So let me clear it up. And then let me re reselect multiple. So in this case, I have to select all the geometries here and everything all, except the. Yes, everything except the surface over this. Okay. I think it should be correct though. Okay. Right. And then hit enter. So now the context is different from the previous. Uh, remember to internalize it. So we now use the new surface to replace the target surface right it doesn't matter where you put it so this is your new target surface and let me delete all the geometry because i already internalized it okay how come oh, i didn't preview it right if you click this one you will see all the rest surface, including this one, will be the context. Mm. So, okay, that's all. That's all you need to specify. Uh, yellow, the yellow component, has something. So, the first step button from left to right is to the EPW weather form. Mm. That one, it will read. It will read. Uh, once it's read, you can see the color is different. Mm. Which means you have put here all the things visualized. Visualize them. Lady Plot. There is a chart component. So, we, if, for example, I, we want to you visualize global horizontal radiation. That's the total. Uh, individual numbers, and uh, there are some text headings you want. So, yes. Whatever left is just numerical value, 8,760 times, 65 days, 24 hours, right? What do you What do you use? Here. Oh, okay. Yeah. So the number, so the 